and welcome back to Let's Play with Beth. We are playing Paper Mario for the Nintendo 64. Alright. So we've already saved there. We have full health. Um, it doesn't refill the star thingy, but it's all good. So we're gonna travel around and we're gonna try to find things and such. And, oh, look at this. What is this? There's a tent in the desert. Well, hello there, old boy. How goes the travels, eh? Oh, maybe I should do that with an English accent, you think? Alright, well. Yeah, I don't have an English accent ready to go. Anyways, <laughs> I'm known as Colorado. I'm an archaeologist, you know? I travel the world. At the moment, I'm turning Dry Dry Desert upside down to find the Dry Dry Ruins. My assistants have attempted to gather information in Dry Dry Outpost, which is near here. Sadly, as of yet, we are having a little... We are having little success. All I need is a clue, and we'll be golden. You're Colorado, correct? The name's Paracary. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter. Duly delivered. The postman's job is never done. Oh, good show. Jolly good show. It's a letter from my wife. Thank you ever so, old chap. This is just what I needed to give me the strength to go on. I know. I'll pass this along as a spot of thanks. I came across it while I was immersed in the dig around here. You got the star piece. Awesome. get to the desert town, dry dry outpost, just go due east from the, on this path. I'd be careful not to stray from the path if I were you. You may find some trouble and you'll definitely get lost. Even the path isn't that safe, so I'd watch out for enemies. Why thank you, sir. We're assisting Professor Colorado. Right now, we're waiting on the guy who hiked over to Dry Dry Outpost to try to bring him back. Dude. Wow. Really? Right now, we're waiting on the guy who hiked over to Dry Dry Outpost to try to bring back some information. Did you know the people of Dry Dry Outpost are descendants of the makers of Dry Dry Ruins? What a cool thought, huh? People have been living here, watching over the ruins for many generations. Seems like a place you could find something hidden. I guess not though. And guess what? I'm not gonna listen to a thing that there's, they've said. Or maybe I will. I don't know. Ooh, I found a coin block. Nope, nope. Oh gosh! You made the first strike. Well, first, I'm going to change to Mario so we can assess the HP and defense of these fellas. Nice block. Nice block. Oh, that was crappy. And he stole coins. What a jerk. This is a bandit. Bandits pump. Into you into you hard and shake up your pockets. They can steal up to ten coins. Max HP five, attack power two, defense power zero. They'll slyly approach and then slam into you all of a sudden. If you can damage them, 
in your attack, you can get your stolen coins back. Let's beat them before they can make off with our loot. So, I'm going to jump on the one that stole my money. And do poorly, and only take one HP from him. And then the other guy steals money, and I blocked that guy, and I blocked that guy. Alright. back that time. There we go. Might as well take that one out if I can. Dang it, and he stole money again. You give that money back, you jerk. Oh, well that was crappy. And that guy stole money. Jeez. There we go. Finally. Took that guy out too. And got a heart. Oh, I hear another one. Alright, I'm gonna go back. Oh, crap. <sighs> Not this again. What do I have? Should I use a thing? Slightly damages all enemies on the ground or ceiling. Well, let's try it, shall we? Nice block. And crap. Well, my money back from that one. And another one bites the dust, and that one takes my money. HP. Oh, look at that! I got enough star power to level up here. panel or whatever and um, get my HP healed back up. Save, but I'll keep so we shall continue. Yep, we're gonna continue on, see if we can find the dry dry outpost that these guys are talking about. Oh, there's another bandit. Oh gosh. Huh. Oh, there's four of you. Lovely. No, I don't think I can use anything. Except I'll try I'll do the quake hammer again though. terrible at blocking. Except for that guy. I wonder if I do the quick hammer thing again if they all drop my money. Oh well that was terrible. I could have done better at that. But at least they, you know, dropped my money. 
Dang it. The timing is so terrible. Feel free to comment on how terrible my timing is. I have so many things chasing me. Run away, run away, run away. Oh no. Oh, and it's a tornado. Hi there, tornado. Hi. Why are you smiling? You're like smiling, but you also have villain eyebrows. Oh, hey. So, how close are we? Hello, fellow travelers. I'm in the middle of a journey, just as you appear to be. Other travelers I meet are like brothers and sisters to me. If a town is what you seek, follow this path to the east. A desert town called Dry Dry Outpost waits at the path's end. Sir. And a coin. Look at that. There's more trees here. Ooh. Deal with that guy. All the trees. Come on. Oh, hey, look, a letter. So, Pear Carry ought to be happy. Who else is in these trees? Shall we look? We shall. Coins. the sign say? Welcome, Dry Dry Outpost. Okay. Hey, look at that! And... Quiz! It's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo! Want to try the quiz? Of course I do. Let's go to the question! Question. What is the color of the block you break with the first hammer you got? Yellow! Correct! Congratulations! Here's your star piece! You've correctly answered two questions so far. Good luck next time! Well, well, so long, farewell, till we meet again. Welcome, travelers. You must have had a long, hot journey getting here. Welcome to Dry Dry Outpost. Mustafa is the leader of this entire town, so you better keep it in mind. Although you probably won't ever see him. Master Mustafa is the main man. Yeah. Master Mustafa is the main, main man. Oh. 
Alright, so that's singing. Yeah, I'm not gonna- I don't want to sing. Let's not sing. Are you aware there's a dojo in town- in Toe Town? There is! A while ago, I took one of the dojo challenges and did pretty well, I must say. I got a second degree card. You look pretty strong, so, huh? You haven't earned any cards. No, no I haven't. In fact, I'm gonna save here. And, let's see, is there anything inside of here? Hello, person, I just kind of barged into your house. Hey, guess what? Hey, somewhere in the desert, there's a stone cactus. If you move three south and two west from there, you'll find something special hidden. Not sure how to find it exactly, however. You should go there, huh? Yeah. Hey, wanna hear something else? I know lots of other stuff. Useful stuff, hey? seen the old fortune teller in Toad Town. He's always right. So his fortune telling is famous. If you hit trouble in the middle of your adventure, it'd be a good idea to see him. Thanks, I'll keep that in mind. Uh oh. Well, I guess we'll walk in here and find out what happened. Temporarily closed. Okay. Are you from Toe Town? Wow, that's a ways away. Dry Dry Ruins? Nope, never heard of it. Sounds like a local fairy tale or something. Hey, if you're serious about looking for Dry Dry whatever, you should go and ask the information trader. Supposedly, this information trader lives in town and swaps information for items or something along those lines. That's what my friend says. My friend? This guy? Nah, he's way too shy to be an information trader. me? A composer I am, writing songs well I try. I wish I could find some lovely heart moving lyrics. I want to compose music filled with beautiful lyrics. It's my fondest, fondest wish. Wow, alright, so again, one of those where I'm tongue tied and I can't talk. part to this town, apparently. A brother and sister who are very close live atop Shooting Star Summit. The brother, Merlot, collects star pieces and will trade badges for them. The sister, Merlot V, is a fortune teller who will tell you where to find badges. Hey, hello! I'm assisting an archaeologist professor in Colorado. I came to Dry Dry Desert but to evacuate Dry Dry Ruins, but it's hot as blazes every day and I'm constantly thirsty. I want to quit and go home. Long ago, in this very land, there was a kingdom called Dry Dry Kingdom. King Mustafa ruled over it. One dark day, he was betrayed by his subjects in the uprising that followed. Dry Dry Kingdom was ruined. King Mustafa escaped and vowed vengeance on his enemies. He gathered those faithful to him and defeated his betrayers. King Mustafa's supporters, the original robber, were the original robbers who built Dry Dry Outpost. Well, there you go, some history on the spot that we're in here. Oh, what's in here? Hey, we can take a nap. Would you like 
like to take a nap? Yes. Yes, we shall. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take a nap here at this... This, uh... Toad... Nap place, whatever the heck you want to call it thing. And you can join me next time. See you guys later. Bye!